हेलो स्टूडेंट्स आज हम टॉपिक पढ़ेंगे इक्विवेलेंस ऑफ सीयर टू ए टेंसाइल एंड ए कंप्रेसिव स्ट्रेन एट राइट एंगल टू ईच अदर एंड ईच इक्वल टू हाफ ऑफ सीयर स्ट्रेन तो इस टॉपिक को शुरू करने से पहले हम कंसीडर करेंगे देर विल बी ए होमोजीनियस क्यूब ऑफ लेंथ एल एंड फ्रंट व्यू से हम इसको समझेंगे लेट दिस विल बी द फ्रंट व्यू ऑफ द क्यूब ए बी सी डी इज द देर इज अ क्यूब एंड ए बी सी डी इज द फ्रंट फेस ऑफ द क्यूब इफ वी अप्लाई ए टेंसाइल फोर्स ऑन अपर फेस ऑफ द क्यूब टेंजेंशियल फोर्स टेंजेंशियल फोर्स ऑन अपर फेस ऑफ द क्यूब एंड लोअर फेस या लोअर एंड गेट इज फिक्सड सी डी इज हेयर फिक्सड एंड वी अप्लाई ए फोर्स टेंजेंशियल फोर्स ऑन द अपर फेस या लेट पैरल टू द आर्क आर्म ए बी ठीक है एंड दिस हैज लेंथ एल एल इज द लेंथ ऑफ द क्यूब दिस इज ऑल्सो एल देन इट गेट डिफॉर्म्ड एंड ए डिसप्लेस्ड टू ए वन एंड ए डैस एंड बी डिसप्लेस टू बी डैस नाउ दिस विल बी द डिफॉर्म्ड सेफ and it get seared through a angle phi as we know that shear strain here is denoted by phi here shear strain is denoted by phi is equals to this displacement let it is l small l this displacement a a1 ya b b1 isko agar aap divide kar doge this length original length of the face that is l this value is l by l this is shear strain this is shear strain this shear strain is this hame ye prove karna hai ki ye shear strain ka half value compressive strain aur tensile strain ke equal hoge aur tensile aur कंप्रेसिव स्ट्रेन एक दूसरे के क्या होंगे परपेंडिकुलर होंगे तो उसको समझने के लिए क्या करते हैं पहले क्या था ए सी और बी डी आर द डायगनल्स ऑफ द फेस इस फेस के जो डायगनल्स थे वो थे ए सी और बी डी आफ्टर डिफॉर्मेशन न्यू डायगनल्स ऑफ दिस जोमेट्री बी से बी बी वन डी न्यू डायगनल्स आर बी डैस डी एंड ए सी जो पहले वाला डायगनल था इट गेट एज ए ए डेस सी ए डेस सी दीज आर द न्यू डायगनल्स आफ्टर सीयर सीयर दिस बी वन डी एज बी डी इज गेट इलोंगेटेड दिस इज टेंसाइल दिस डायगनल बी डी गेट टेंसाइल टू ए न्यू डायगनल दैट इज बी डैस डी और दिस इफ यू वॉन्ट टू find the tensile in this diagonal so let us draw a perpendicular from b to this b dash d pe ek perpendicular draw kar lenge let it is point as n okay also to find the compression in ac get compressed new length is a1c it get compressed its length get decreased and to find the Uh, decrease ya compression in this diagonal ac let us draw a perpendicular from a dash to ac let this point is as m now the shear this angle shear angle is very small so we can take this angle as 90 degree and this is also nearly 90 degree and this nine angle is 90 degree and this is also nearly 45 this is 45 this is also 45 so we uh, we can say that this new triangle b n b dash b n b dash is right angled isosceles right angled angled isosceles theek hai so this bn is equal to b dash n here bn is equals to b dash n and this will be equals to uh, b b dash into cos of cos of 45 this is equals to b b dash into cos of 
45 using right angle triangle uh, based on hypotenuse that is cos theta cos 45 from here this bn this bn dash bollo ya bn bollo and this also am ya a dash m also equals in length and they are also equals to l into ya a a dash into cos of 45 degree and this bb dash is as we take l this is also displaced by same length l this will be l into cos 45 1 by root 2 this is l by root 2 this is also l by root 2 so we find that the extension yeah tensile in this diagonal this db length get increased by b dash n to so increase in this the, yeah you can say that uh, there is tensile in the diagonal BD that tensile yeah, increase in length is B dash N or is ki jo value hai that is L by root 2. If we want to find the tensile strain so that will be the ratio of change in configuration by original configuration. So original diagonal ki hume length chahiye ki or ye original diagonal of the face kya hota hai this L this is L and at right angle to each other then the value of the face diagonal is uh, by Pythagoras theorem that is L square plus L square under the root. So the length of the diagonal is BD principal diagonal that is L square plus L square under the root that is root 2 L. This is original length. If we want to find the tensile strain, so tensile strain will be tensile strain in diagonal in diagonal BD BD get tensile BD that tensile strain is that is increase in length that is B dash n B dash n is L by root 2 divided by original length of the diagonal that is L root 2 L root 2 into L this value will be L by capital L root 2 into root 2 that is 2 and this L by L is 5 shear strain so it is equals to 5 by 2 5 by 2 so tensile strain hoga along the diagonal db that is equals to half of the half of the tensile half of the shear strain similarly agar hum dekhenge diagonal ac ke liye for diagonal ac for diagonal ac AC के लिए क्या हुआ? AC get uh, compressed to A1C, A dash C. तो A dash C and the compression को अगर divide कर देंगे this AM को, if we divide with the original length of the diagonal AC, that will be compressive strain. Compressive strain in diagonal AC, that will be AM by AC. AM is the length as we drive here that is small L by root 2 L by root 2 or original length of the diagonal root 2 L and this again L by L or root 2 into root 2 that is half of L by capital L small L by capital L as we know is the shear strain and this is also equal to half of shear strain ye hame prove karna hai topic ke andar ki jo compressive strain in one diagonal and extension yeah, com tensile strain in the uh, diagonal BD that are equivalent to each other meaning that are equals to shear strain ke aap ke equal hai ye bhi aur shear strain ke aap ke equal hai wo bhi to dono ke dono kya hai ek dusre ke equivalent hai aur half hai kiske shear strain ke aur dusra ek dusre ke right angle pe kaam karte hain kyunki these diagonals are right angle to each other thanks for watching